For the CircuitPython Parsec today, I wanted to show you how to calibrate a touch controller. So you can see here, I've got a resistive touch controller and what I'm displaying there is an X position and a Y position and the touch pressure. So you'll see here, when I go all the way up to the top, I kind of expect that to be a zero and it's not, it's around 12. And when I go to the bottom, I expect that to be about 240 and it's not, it's around 220. So this clearly needs to be calibrated. If you look in my code here, you'll see we are including this calibration line that says essentially the minimum and maximum values that we're getting on the screen for X and Y. These are the defaults. I don't know what display those were done on, but it's not this exact one that I have here, so those are off. So you can use this excellent script that Cedar Grove Maker wrote that we have up on the GitHub going to ask me to calibrate by essentially using a stylus the full range left and right and up and down. Uh, you'll notice at first this little dot is going to kind of be way off because it thinks the calibration values are something that are definitely wrong. But the beauty of this is as I go and set a minimum and a maximum on X, you'll see it's tracking a little better, and as I set a minimum and a maximum on Y, uh, we now get really tight tracking of that cursor dot there. That's fantastic. Uh, and it has spit out some values there that you could just copy and paste out of your REPL. So you'll see in my REPL, now I have this tuple that says a minimum and a maximum value that are quite different than what I was using before. So I'm gonna copy those. I'm going to go ahead and paste them into whatever my real sketch is, whatever my real code is. In this case, uh, I'm just gonna be looking at, at some numbers. So I'm gonna paste that in there, very different values. Hit save, uh, and now you can see, if you look at my X, Y values, they will go down to zero on X, up to 320 on X, down to zero on Y, and up to 240 on Y. So now I have really nice tracking that I can use for whatever I wanna use my touch controls for. And that is how you can calibrate a touch screen inside of CircuitPython. That is your CircuitPython Parsec.